Alright guys, so today I'm gonna show you how to take audio off of a video file and then and turn it into a song to be used in your iTunes library. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to Google and type in AOA. -A. As you can see, um, audio extractor right there. So we're gonna search that and click on the first link that comes up. You should see a page like this. And you don't need to buy the platinum one, you can get the audio extractor extractor for free so just uh, download that and once you have that downloaded open it up and it should look like this so I was recently taking the audio off this track I have right here and what you can basically do is you can go into your um, iTunes library down here and simply drag in any um, video clip that you already have as you can see, um, I've shortened some video clips down here so they're just um, part of a song. So what you can do is you can drag that directly into um, the file uh, manager here. And you can add files, but that's a much more complicated process. So once you have your file here, you can uh, set the output options to MP3, WAV, or AC3. I would recommend doing MP3 so then you can get it to play on your iPod. And for bitrate, you have quite a few options here, going all the way up to 320, which is a uh, very high quality. So um, what I chose to do was 192, which is you know pretty good. So and then you can do, um, do the audio sample rate. You can change this uh, however you want. And um, s for the channel, mono and stereo, stereo, so it'll play out of both speakers, and then mono is just uh, the same sound out of both speakers. So. Um, I'm going to do stereo, and then all we do is hit start. As you can see, the clip is 2 minutes and 51 seconds, so we're going to do a real time uh, demonstration here. Okay, so uh, it's done, and I chose down here you can put um, the output path I just saved it to uh, my music my my music folder so uh, up here it'll bring up your my music right, so guys here in my music folder we can simply select that and drag that straight into the iTunes library and then it appears right there we can rename that uh, to whatever you want it you know I'm just gonna call it um, new song for now and just set that like that. Now, all you have, if we scroll down to that new song, all you have is that, um, that just that audio clip and not the video that used to be uh, with it. So that's how you rip audio from a video file using the AOA audio extractor. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, see ya.